Hey guys, it's Ishani, aka Total Makeup Junkie 101. So today I'm going to be doing a tutorial for you guys. Yay! I know I basically never do tutorials. And the reason for that, I know a lot of you guys really want me to do more tutorials and I'm going to try to, but the only reason I don't is because I feel like I'm not the best at tutorials and I feel like there are so many other gurus on here who are so much better than me, but I will try. I will practice and I will try to get good for you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoy this one. This is a look that I've been wearing in a couple of my previous videos and I've gotten tons and tons and tons of requests for a tutorial on it and I am basically just using my Urban Decay Smoked Palette for this tutorial. I absolutely adore this palette and I've been talking about it in a lot of my recent videos. It's just got the best range of smoky eyeshadows. It's the best eyeshadow palette for a smoky eye. So I posted a picture of this exact makeup look on my Instagram. If you guys don't know, I did get an Instagram account and I will put my um, Instagram username in the description box below for you guys if you want to follow me there. But I have been doing some previews of a lot of my um, videos that I've been posting as well as of course random pictures of just my life so if you guys want to follow me there please please do so as you guys can tell this look is a really really smoky eyeshadow look um, but consists of some blue shadows which I think is really pretty I personally really like the colored smoky eyes as opposed to the traditional black and silver smoky eye so if you guys want to know how to achieve this look step by step just keep watching alrighty guys so we're gonna start off by priming our eyes using Urban Decay Primer Potion. Alrighty, so we're just going to apply some onto the eyelids and also we're going to take some on the lower lash line because shadow will be going there. Just blend that out with your ring finger. Alrighty, now we're going to take our Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Pencil in the shade Binge and we're actually going to be using this eyeliner as an eyeshadow base. So I'm just going to apply it all over my eyelid, getting it all the way up into the crease. And then we're also going to get some on our lower lash line. And then taking your ring finger, just blend it out a little bit. Okay, now we're going to jump right into the smoked palette. And I'm going to go right in here with this um, really pretty jewel tone blue shade called Evidence on a flat shader brush. Pack shadow onto one side of that brush and then tap it off. And then you're going to start placing it onto your eyelid. You're not going to go in all the way with this. You're going to start probably about one third of the way in and then go about until you hit one third of the way out. So just use the middle third of your lid. Okay, once we have that color placed, we're just going to flip over the brush and use the other side of our shader brush and take it right into this shade called Mushroom in the Smoked Palette. And you're going to place it on the inner one third of your eyelid and then kind of overlapping some of that blue that we put there. This shade is a really, really gorgeous kind of taupey shade and I just love the way the blue looks with the taupe. And then you can kind of go back and forth between the blue and the taupe to kind of blend the two colors together. Alright, now we're going to go right over here. This is blackout in the palette. It's the darkest matte black and we're going to take an even more flat synthetic brush and you're just going to place it right on the outer one third of your lid. So just get it out here and we will blend it out using another brush. This brush is simply to place the color where we want it. Alright, once we have that color placed, you guys can see it's really, really harsh. So we are going to take just a blending brush and just blend out the edges. And you're also ever so slightly going to blend this black right up into the crease here and just get a really nice fade going up to your brow bone. All right, now that that is done, we are going to start with our lower lash line. So I'm just going to take the um, evidence color again on a small pointed brush. Just get it on about the middle one third of your lower lash line. All right, now we're taking blackout on the same brush and just getting it on the outer part of our lower lash line and then just kind of connecting it up into the lid and then we're going to take mushroom on the same brush and getting it on the inner one third of your lower lash line kind of overlapping the blue just to get a good fade all right now we're going back to the smoked palette and taking this really light cream shade called kinky and just taking that on a fluffy brush to just highlight our brow bone okay and then lastly to highlight our very inner corner we're just going to take a shade from the Too Faced Natural Eye palette 
and it is this shade here called Silk Teddy. And just get it right here in this very inner corner just to bring some light into here. Okay, now we're just going to take a black eyeliner pencil. This one is the uh, Makeup Forever Aqua Eyes in the black one. It really doesn't matter. Just take any black eyeliner pencil and just kind of smudge it on your upper lash line. Alright, then we're also going to line our waterline with this pencil. And then we're also going to line our upper tight line using this pencil. Okay, now we're going to line our upper lash line a little bit more precisely using the L'Oreal Carbon Black Linear Intense felt tip liquid liner and we're just gonna apply a really really thin line to the upper lash line now the reason we use both pencil and liquid liner on our upper lash line is because the pencil gives a really smudgy smoky look whereas the liquid gives a really nice precise look so when you layer them together, you'll kind of get a little bit of that smoky smudginess, yet still a really nice dark black lash line. Alright, now we are just going to curl our lashes, and then we're just going to apply two coats of mascara to our upper and lower lashes. And the mascara I'm using is the Benefit their real mascara. Ooh, it is lopsided. Benefit their real. Don't forget to get your lower lashes because you have so many dark shadows down there. You definitely don't want your bottom lashes to get lost. Alrighty guys, that is it for eyes. Now I will zoom you out and show you what I did for the rest of my face. Alrighty guys, now for cheeks. I'm just going to keep it really, really simple for cheeks since there's so much going on on the eyes. I'm just going to be using my MAC blush in the shade Instant Chic. It's just a really pretty matte, dusty pink. So we're just going to swirl that onto the cheeks. I'm not going to be using a highlighter for this look. You can if you want to, but I'm just going to try to keep my skin really matte since the smoky eye takes up, you know, a lot. All right, and then for lips, like I said, keeping the rest of the face really neutral. So I'm just going to be using this Revlon Lip Butter in the shade Brown Sugar. It's just a really pretty kind of bronzy neutral shade. Just getting that onto the lips. So that is it. That is how you guys can achieve this exact makeup look. Um, products mentioned and all of that good stuff will be in the description box below as well as a link to my Facebook fan page, my Twitter page, and my Instagram name. So be sure to follow me on Instagram if you don't already. And that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial and I will talk to you guys very, very soon. Bye!